A common question we get is, what's the best way to share content in a Microsoft Teams Room meeting? Personally, I'm a fan of the wireless cast feature, which is built into Teams natively. In this video, we'll take a look at how this is done. The first step is to access Teams settings from your Teams client using the ellipses in the upper right hand corner of the screen. Choose Cast. If you're within Bluetooth range of an open Microsoft Teams meeting room, it will show up in the ensuing menu. For this example, we'll use Dallas Huddle Room and then choose Next. Teams will then prompt you for what content you wish to cast. You'll notice that we have all available screens as well as any open windows. For this example, we'll simply choose a monitor screen and then click Cast. A Teams meeting will then be initiated with the meeting room and will be presented with the typical Teams meeting client on our desktop. Now let's take a look at what this looks like on the meeting room system. Here we see the RX pad display as well as the TV display that's connected to the RX V81 collaboration bar. This room is configured for auto answer, which we'll cover in another video, but notice how once we click cast from the desktop, the meeting starts on the MTR device. And shortly after the meeting starts, you'll see our shared content of the blank monitor screen that we chose from the desktop. And that's it. Casting is a great way to effortlessly share content with Teams MTR devices from audio codes.